Welcome to Skate Factory, located at 485 27th Avenue, Southwest, Vero Beach, Florida. They do have a small selection of games for kids to play. There was also a counter where there was prizes that you could win. I'm assuming there was tickets. I did not stop to play any of the games. All clips shown in this video were recorded during the Thursday night adult skate session. I'm gonna have to say, out of the nine rinks that I have visited since staying in Florida, the surface of the floor in this rink was by far the worst. I'm not sure if some of it had to do with the wheel selection that I had on my current skates, but overall it was a really awful floor. There were about five or six skaters that were really good. Uh, I didn't really get many clips of people doing individual things, but I did record quite a bit of footage throughout the night. Uh, I did get bumped about 60 times by people who shouldn't have been skating in the outer lane of the skate floor. For the most part, I'm lucky if I could even go six miles per hour in the outer ring, which is supposed to be for fast people. I spent most of the night breaking. The music selection in this rink was really good in my opinion. I don't let bad music bother me, but again, it was really good. I didn't have any issues with the music. The lighting was pretty bad as far as recording, but it did set a good mood in the place with the lighting that was there. Most people probably don't think to record while they're there, so the lighting probably doesn't bother your average person. The music itself was really loud, which seems to be a thing in Florida rinks that I've been to so far. They said it insanely loud for some reason, I can't figure out why, but it seemed about average volume-wise with what I've experienced in other rinks in the area. I did try eating the food at the rink, I have to say. I was quite impressed with the quality of the food that I did try. They actually made it fresh as well, which you don't see in many rinks. They did do a reverse direction backward skate, which I found interesting. I've never actually seen that done at a rink before. I'm pretty bad, in my opinion, at going in reverse, so I did do a couple laps, but I cleared off the floor after doing a couple of laps. They also did an advanced skater session. They had quite a lot of people stay on the floor that I wouldn't deem advanced. There should have been maybe a dozen or so people on the skate floor at the time during the advanced session. This is the end of my review. I did record a lot of footage during the advanced skating. That's what's going to be playing now. It will also have the original audio so you can get a taste of what the music sounded like throughout the night.
Yeah, that's all, folks.